prank call people, we should do that. Dom, hello guys, I'm in LA. Dom is telling me all these stories of when she was bullying our friends, prank calling them, but it wasn't nice. Anyways, I'm in LA and I made a list of, of some things that I needed to say in this intro. A PSA. Number one, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. I was, I had a flashback to this moment when, you know, I've been flying first class a lot recently. Oh. And then today, 30 C, which I like an aisle. And I was like, this is just so different than it once was. And I used to be that bitch that was like, I don't care. Literally, and I'm like, wait a second. No, 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 no. I take no, that. No, 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 no. I, because I remember when we went to New York, like five ever ago, like the first time I like, Remember when we went like mm -hmm. five F, yep. and you dead ass went. I don't even care if we sit in the last seat, and I kind of because like I I normally and I, I think that's just like the Texas thing in me of like I just don't care. Well, and I was just like yeah, but like the last seat. <laughs> I didn't really mean that. Like but, like like the the farthest I'll go back is maybe like eighteen, like eighteen nineteen. As soon as oh, it hit, I'm not like that. As soon as it hits twenty, I'm like. Fuck, but like, Dom is more of the like once the the bougie experience. Not even the bougie experience. I just want convenience. Like I want to know yeah. where I'm sitting. I want to know that I'm not too far back. Not too like like I usually sit at twelve. Like ten or twelve is where I sit. Yeah, and I don't know why because I really I genuinely with my whole heart and not in like a pick me way. I genuinely felt that way. What are you, what was that? No, like, I'm just, like... It's no, just, I genuinely felt that way. And I would like to retract my statement. If I can fly first class, I want to fly first class. Like, totally. No, but, like, why wouldn't you? But, honestly, for the biggest reason being that I can get off the plane first and my bag comes out first. That's yeah. That's really enough for me. That's... Number two. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm. So, apparently, I hate everyone. And, like, I'm not the people, people, people person that I thought I was. The guy next to me on my flight... Oh, he wouldn't shut the fuck up? No, worse. He was sitting there, looking at his, well, watching something on his phone, laughing out loud the entire thing, and apparently I'm just a bitch who doesn't want other people to experience joy because I hated every single minute of it. The but more he that, would smile, the more he would laugh. I'm like, shut up. Why would, like, why, why would he do that? I don't know. He just kept doing it. And I don't think that's horrible. I think that's a very fair way to feel because, to be honest, if a guy did that to me, like... The ick. I would literally be like, holy, shut your pie hole. Like, literally shut your pie hole. We're on a plane. That, like, would you want a baby laughing and crying? No. Well, I have sympathy for babies. I have sympathy for babies. The parents. But still, you don't, I don't want any noise on my plane. The more he laughed, the more I hated him. And I'm like, I'm a horrible person. But why is he laughing? Like, stop. I don't know. It was loud, too. No, like, why are you it laughing? Really something. Like, so if y'all are new here, um, and that's, <laughs> this is the first conversation you've heard. I'm not normally this horrible. Um, but I did want to retract some statements and I did want to give y'all a little PSA. We are... I'm um, going to get dinner right now. I need to put my. We're in the we're in the big cinnamon apple. We are not in the big cinnamon apple. I wish I was in the. Big we cinnamon. are in the big toaster strudel. I love the big cinnamon apple. Um, I need a little outfit pick. What did you just grab? I put my bag down, and oh. um, I have a TikTok I'm gonna make that Dom's really excited to. Yeah, my phone died. I have TikToks for us to make too. It's grab. So subscribe if y'all are new here. Welcome to. And um, Los Angeles week in my life. Welcome, welcome. You're trying to embarrass me in front of my friends, Dom. Okay. Can you think? Should she... you show them my outfit? Oh yeah. Hi. Also, guys, Shoe. this is my this is my kitchen. Shoe. Sorry, I don't know why I did that. I have a matching crew. Wait, wait, wait. Turn back around. Cute. Boom. I have a matching crew. Dom forgot to get an Instagram photo, so. I just need one for like a little like photograph kind of vibe. Just have yeah. some on deck. But yeah. Don doesn't care about my Instagram career, so whatever. Anyways, um, I I don't know how many Dalmatians I've ever been around in my life. Do you guys think I'm naked? I'm not. <laughs> I'm wearing a dress. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm thinking about? You know what I've been loving? JC's vlogs are incredible. JC texted me and told me how much she loves my vlogs, and I was like. We should hang out with her. Oh, uh, well, um, I'm actually getting dinner with her on Thursday, but you're going to be gone. So, sorry. Anyways, um, but she does, like, the OG thumbnails where it's just one thumbnail. Like, no photos, and it's, like, one shot filmed in, you know, so I think I might, maybe I need to change something. I need to revamp this YouTube channel. I'm going to make some changes. So, what do you think? 
So yeah. it's such a gamble. What if no one watches it? No, I feel like people are like, I look great. You know? For a long day, I look pretty awesome. Two chests. Thanks. Jerf Avenue. It's Jerf Avenue. Thank you, Matilde. Matilde, thank you. Bam. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was me on my date. <laughs> Good morning guys, it's Monday morning. I have Dom's car right now and I'm heading it to Peebov. It's like 6.45. Back on my early morning workouts and I love when I do this when I'm in LA at the very beginning because it makes my life so much easier because my time right now, it's 8.45 and in LA it is 6.45. So going to Peebov and then I'm gonna get Alfred and bring it back for us after. Um, I went here once with Maddie from okay Sis and I've done, they've sent me like they're like workout stuff, um, and I've worked out with them from home, so anyways. Gonna go. You know, I guess I'm really tired. Oh, I'll be fine. Guys, look at Dominique in here. A little working gal, made some breakfast. I love this life. It's really nice. Oh, you have an art place pan? Love, oh, look at the detail. I got it, I got it from the Hue Habitat for Humanity for $20. No way. Brand new. Wow, I love mine. Guys, we just came all the way to Zinc. By all the way, I mean my studio's right there, but like, it's closed forever. Okay, forever? Yeah, it's real. Look at it. Like, oh, shit. It's close, close. Okay, so you know why I asked you that? It's because in the car when I looked up the address. It didn't show here? It showed Century City. <gasps> no, I'm really, really sad. Uh, feeling a little bit heartbroken. Feeling a little bit let down. Yeah. But we will go to Gracias Mondre and it will be okay. But I was really looking forward to my chicken label. But I do know how to make from home now, but it's not the same. It's never the same. Dom and I are fighting because I want to watch Twilight and I finally have something I want to watch with her and she's against it. I, what? Here's the thing, Kenzie. You want to re-watch stuff that came out like 10 years ago. Yeah, because I only like comfort watches. Um, I heard that that's like an anxiety thing. <laughs> but listen, I remember, it, this is not a spoiler alert because if you haven't read the books or watched them by now, that's on you. I remember exactly where I was when Jacob imprinted Almond Esme. I was in my mom's first rental post-divorce, really low point in my life. I was sitting in my bedroom and I was reading these books. I was like sixth grade, fifth grade summer. And I remember reading it, my jaw dropped, and I remember getting up and being like, oh my god, mom, and I had to tell her. Wow. Isn't that just so crazy? I know that all of you guys were dying to hear that story, and you were like, you know what? I want to know exactly where Kinsey was when she figured out that Rene that Jacob imprinted on Renee's So there you go. I just wanted to share my truth and share my story with you guys. Yeah, no, and I... And are we, are we better for it? I think we're a lot better for it. Thank you so much, really appreciate it. Anyways, now we're going to Gracias Madre. I mean, at this point, maybe we'll even go to Cha Cha Macha. Just kidding. Maybe I'm not. <laughs> There's Verve, too. Mm, yeah. I don't like Verve. Isn't that crazy? I really, I've never liked Verve. I'm, for the sake of- You knew that before, though. No. For the sake and safety of our friendship, I'll just pretend I didn't hear that. Mm. Like, you know my whole entire- I know, and I don't like it. It, it just like, okay, I'm really specific with iced coffee because if it's too acidic, it makes me really sick and really anxious. So that's why I go to like Starbucks and I know I can drink theirs or a blue bottle, but like I just, something about Verb like literally gives me, I feel like I'm having a heart attack mm. and I get like sick and I get iced coffee. Mm. I'm not like a vanilla, iced vanilla latte girl, but I would do it for you at Verve. You know what? Let's go to Verb today. <laughs> hey, gracias. <laughs> Look at how good this looks, unreal. I got the chocolate trio, beautiful. All right, well I got an iced oat milk latte, vanilla, because I stressed and I didn't know what to order. <sighs> we'll see. All right, 
Wait, just left the studio. We're fighting over Sonic food. Pro Sonic. I'm John and Vinny's for dinner. I have a splitting headache. I've changed immediately upon leaving. Good morning, y'all. It has been a night. I just got my blue bottle. Dom and I are heading to the studio. This morning, we're recording with Keaton, and then I'm recording another one um, on like skincare. I had an allergic reaction last night, I think. Like, I, I don't know what's wrong with my body. It just like, keep falling apart. But, like, my throat is very allergic reaction y, if that makes sense. So, anyways, going to the studio, I only have two episodes today. I didn't do the first one this morning. Um, but yeah, I need to drink coffee. Oh my god. Whew. I can't wait for my nap today. I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah. How are you, Dom? I'm good. Had a nice morning. Um, did some cleaning and some laundry. And, oh, yeah. So nice. Very nice. And peace in the Middle East. Oh, so nice. Slay <laughs> if you want to slay. Thank you. Slay, slay out. Wow. Do you have a Christmas rendition of that too? I want to see you slay. Mm -hmm. uh, let me think. Slay bells ring. We might want to whisper this one. Slay bells slay. Oh. Are you slaying? Oh, wow. And well, when the other guests the sleigh, get here, I'll be back here right now. I want to walk them for being able Bells to are slaying. A sleigh and a sleigh. Wow. A boots in a house. <sighs> walking in a winter wonder sleigh. That was beautiful, Dom. Thank you for sharing. The captions were the next lyric after what I... Guys, so cute. Oh, wow. We, really still we just slayed. Like, yeah, really. We just got slayed. <laughs> we just got slayed. <laughs> Literally. Like, that's actually what just happened. No, that was a good episode. All right, guys. Um, sorry, there's been minimal vlogging today. Honestly, just been a working girl. And then uh, vlogging at the studio is kind of boring. But Dominique is here, and I've been antisocial. And conveniently, like, most people are out of town this week, so I didn't have a social pressure. Yeah. I'm sorry you guys are seeing my bed with no bed sheets on right now. It's just kind of what's happening. Yeah, where are they, by the way? They're in the dryer. I forgot to move them from the washer earlier today. Yeah, story of my life. Um, so it's just we're, we've been like this. Um, so I, I wanted to talk to you guys because there's something that I want well, a proposal really, Kenzie. I think that you should let me use your photos to catfish people. Okay. I feel like that is somehow unethical. But like I'll make it your name Kenzie. No. And then and then I'll So you wanna run at and then I'll link your Instagram below and um it's not catfishing, that's called like, no. Why? I, no, it's not, I'm not interested. Why? Mm, no, Ugh. Um, okay, well that was worth a shot. Guys, I'm having another dilemma. I have two hours left in my book and I'm like extremely exhausted. So, I think this is really just a intervention for you, Kenzie, and I kind of let everyone know beforehand that we need to have a very real and honest conversation. Um, so, here it goes nothing. I think it's extremely rude that you don't want to watch The Summer I Turn Pretty, and you only want to rewatch shows that were created in 2000, 2012 and back. I offered to watch Catfish with you today. Kenzie, on what? I don't know. I don't know how you watch shows. And you just figure it out. You Google where to watch. That's what I do. Keep in mind, she has like three TVs in her house. <laughs> yeah, I know. I have four, actually. One of them's all plugged in. Um, but I watch YouTube on the TVs. YouTube girl. But I know I need to watch Summer I Turn Pretty because, obviously. And so, I did, so those are my favorite books that. growing up. So let's unpack that. Why haven't we? Well, I started watching it, and honestly, the characters just annoyed me, and I turned it off. 
I'm not kidding. I was on a flight and I paid for Wi-Fi to watch it and I was like, why are they annoying me? And I know I, I know I would like it because everyone else likes it, but like something, it, they were just annoying me. You really, I wonder what, why? That never it? happens to me. Like people really don't annoy me. Like, I feel shows? like TV annoys you. Mm -hmm. Like, I really, truly do feel like TV annoys me. Yeah, but remember when you said you were going to read one book a week? Yeah. And if I bought you a Kindle? Yeah, and, and I'm I bought doing, her a Kindle. And guys, I'm really doing not too shabby. Yeah, you're actually doing pretty good. And I can finish... How are you feeling about the book? I really, really, really enjoy it. Um, Kenzie was sleeping next to me the other night, and I kept going... <gasps> no, I wasn't sleeping, because she kept doing that. Mm -hmm. Um, well, there's a lot of dramatic. She's reading Seven Husbands. I'm reading The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. Mm -hmm. And, um, Evelyn, Evelyn Hugo's been through a lot. Yeah. She's been through a lot. So basically, guys, sorry that this LA vlog is, um, not really me out and about much. I'm just recording a lot, and I just am tired. And I don't really want to go places. Like, I would love to go to the Palisades, but I don't have time. Like, I, I don't know. You I don't know? Have time either. We can more go, just Kenzie and Dom. Thursday morning before my flight. When is your flight? Also, if you want to take me to the airport, that'd be baller. When's your flight? It leaves at 4 30. I am in the studio. I know, I figured. I'm in the studio from 2 to 5. Oh, well, that's perfect. Because I have to get to my flight two hours early. Um, actually, sorry, I'm not, I didn't see the other one. I really wasn't making that up, I didn't see the recording before. So, I don't know, maybe Dom will, um, watch Catfish with me. I already, you know what's so rude about this little white girl right here? Is I've invited her into my room to watch Catfish multiple times. And she said, She's literally lying to you guys. You want to know she what, is what lying she to just guys. said? She said, no, I can't watch it because I took this tea that's going to make me sleepy. Well, sleepy. that is true. Pretty soon I will probably fall asleep. Okay, then. then no, I, finish what you were going to say. No, I'm practicing. No, finish what you were going to say. I'm practicing kindness. Yeah, she just didn't want the cameras. You guys think Dom is so nice. See, that's not oh, the truth. Oh, I watched. Okay, wait. Serious talk. Is anyone else watching the show Claim to Fame? It's this Is new that show. the Jonas show? Yeah, with the Jonas Brothers, where they're trying to guess who's re who I would the, like that. their celebrity relative is. Oh, I already watched the first episode last night. Did you guess right? Who's no, but one girl is obviously Simone Simone Biles. Yeah. Do they just look alike or something? Like that's her twin. Yeah. And everyone's like, she's my layup. Like she's my layup. Like if whatever, then I'm gonna use her. Um, what a kid. Oh, also, I tried to like deep dive to like find out who everyone else is, and they're really keeping shit under wraps right now. Well, anyways, it's been real, guys. See you tomorrow. Recording two swaps in the studio. Um, the Balance Blonde and Lindsay Carter. Oh, well, that's fun. Yep, just a big swap girl these days, you know. All right, guys. Good morning. It is currently Wednesday. Um, I am eye trailing my face. I just ordered some breakfast. I'm in the studio all day today, and then depending on how much work I get done today, I might be able to go to Tristan's knitting party, which I'm really looking forward to. Um, so I'm just eye trailing my face. I'm about to do my skincare, fully get ready, give myself a little blowout. Today I'm recording with Lindsay Carter of Set Active, and then um, Jordan Younger, who is the Balanced Blonde. We're gonna have some great episodes, I think, even in the new studio. Well, yesterday I recorded with these skin experts and like I learned so much. I had no idea. So now I'm really excited to like try out those products and stuff and let you guys know. Anyways, I need to get ready. And I think I'm gonna go cozy in the studio. This has been a very low key week. So I'm thinking going cozy. Dom leaves tomorrow. She's going on like a brand trip and then I leave Friday. So I'm just gonna stay here next year. Um, I leave Friday morning. So, we'll see if I end up actually venturing outside the house besides going to the studio. Normally, in my LA vlogs, I have, like, more to do. Um, and honestly, I've just been, like, tired, so. And have other stuff that I need to do. So, time for a little OOTD. Outfits this week are very simple. Top is skims. Bra is skims. Almost everything on my body is skims. This, I don't even know what this is called. But the material is, I don't even, I don't even know how to describe it. It's just the best material ever. It's really flattering and it's very soft, but it's like a little bit thicker, almost like scuba-y. 
Jeans are my favorite jeans from Abercrombie with the like slits in the side. And then I have my favorite heels from Revolve that I've been wearing a lot. Guys, I made it to TK's. I don't even think I vlogged at the studio today. Um, but here I am. And I immediately came here. Wear ring? Yeah. <gasps> but I wear it on my wrong finger, but it doesn't matter. It still okay. works. Um, and I'm wearing sweats that I stole. And she ordered me sushi. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. We're just sitting outside now with our beautiful sushi. <laughs> it looks incredible. The it's kind views. of a vibe. It's definitely a vibe, um, and it feels incredible out, so it's a great day to be out. All right, we just ordered Yogurt Land. Molly and I used to order Yogurt Land when we lived downtown. Love. Like, every night. Um, okay, toppings. Kind of getting chilly now. It is. Okay, guys, here's my toppings. Well, first off, I did the birthday cake, Yogurt Land. Oh my god, oh, there's you did. so much of this, no wonder. Um, I did the, like, plain tart. tart. Gummy worms. Cookie dough and strawberry, always my choice. That's a lot, like I'm gonna have to. I did gummy worms too. Where are they? Wait, did they not give us all? No, they didn't, but we can just. It's okay, we'll them. split. Yeah. I definitely got blueberries no, too. No, and I also I saw your order and that's not what it was. No. Okay, Well, Sweet. <laughs> Maybe that's a substitution. Wow. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Incredible. Guys, Kenzie and I got yogurt land. Really? Sweet. Everything I needed. Slay. The perfect way to end the night. <laughs> it is. Now it's coloring time, guys. It's a really <laughs> wild night. It's my favorite time of the day. It's just so peaceful. Okay, TK. I'm up way past my bedtime, only for you. Honestly, we caught up on so much. I know. I've been here for like six hours now. That was so fun. But I know. we need to hang out more. <laughs> it's like when you barely know someone, the way you're talking is like, we should talk soon. Like, we should talk more. Yes, guys, I agree. I've known Kenzie for so long. I know. But I feel like it's just hard to keep up. Like, yeah. it's weird because I keep up with you, obviously, via social media, but like... Well, we keep up when we see each other. And also, you're not only are we internet friends, but like, you know what my entire like yeah. family... Like, We're like really, really, really friends. Yeah. Yeah, oh my god. I thought We're watching why. Danny. Oh. Just Julia texting me. <laughs> Sucks, doesn't it? Bro, I'm <laughs> You really are. Like, I hate boys, you guys. You, you definitely Pray don't. For me. Manifest. Yeah, we'll start praying for you. Yeah. Anyway. On my podcast been... today, the girl taught me how to like visualize your future self and visualize your future partner. Okay. That's what you need to do. So you need to start thinking like I'm sitting courtside with six my four. MBA husband, six four. Yeah. Massive, ginormous, giant. Yeah. Um, so comment down below if you think that Kenzie and I should do a house swap. Oh yeah, we want to do that. Sounds like a good idea. And I will go to Dallas and rage! <laughs> It'll be so fun. Anyway. Bye! Doodles. Okay guys, it is later tonight. Um, tomorrow's my last day in LA, but I'm in the studio basically all day. It was so good to just like hang out and lay around with TK and basically do nothing. Um, tomorrow I'm recording I think four episodes. I have meetings in between that, so I'll be vlogging. I'm gonna see JC and Chelsea, which I'm excited for. I think we're getting dinner. The only thing that I'm sad about for this trip is that I didn't go to the Mud Happy store and I didn't go to the Palisades. Um, but other than that, honestly, it's fine. So, I'm about to get to do my skincare. Let me show you what I've been using. Um, I've been using the Curology cleanser, which I love, but I ran out, so I have the Inculus Hyaluronic cleanser. Sorry, I'm whispering because it's late. This Curology Nighttime Serum, not serum, what even is it technically? I don't even know, this is like the prescription one, the one that's like personalized to your skin. Unbelievable overnight treatment. Um, I've been like messing around with skincare again and like changing it up, but I do want to say, still loving Road, my skin has never felt softer. Um, and then I've also been using this beauty oil, 
I don't even really know to use the you know, other it's just really moisturizing and Danielle posted about it and I bought it immediately. So love that. And then I've also been loving my like ball massager from the Skinny Confidential. Great, love that. But anyways, that's my little skincare favorites. Also, in all seriousness, I've been feeling like super, not even burnt out, but just like uninspired with YouTube lately. And like I know Brooke recently said this and like, I don't know, like I feel like I just am not super inspired and then like i feel like i'm on autopilot with it and like i don't necessarily want to make videos other than vlogs besides like maybe a fun like few fun like collab videos and stuff but like i feel like i need to like do like a shock to my system and change it up and i'm like so focused on the podcast and i'm like on autopilot with youtube but i just like don't know what videos to make and i just i don't know i feel like i've been kind of dealing with this the past like probably like two years but I don't know, not in the way that's like complaining. I'm really grateful and I love YouTube and I love my job and like it's I, like my first love. I just am more so like feeling uninspired and like not knowing what to do. Not that I'm not gonna do it, obviously. Um, but I don't know, let me know those thoughts. I feel like everything I do is redundant and then it's just getting really boring and then I don't live much around a bunch of like other influencers so I'm not like filming with people all the time and like it's just kind of hard when like no one around me is like doing the same thing so I don't have people like bounce ideas off of. Obviously, there's, like, pros to that, too, but, like, I don't know. I just, like, don't know what, I don't know what I want to do with my channel. Like, I feel like there's other things that I could be doing, and I just don't know what I want to be doing and what I should be doing or what I want to be doing. Would love any and all feedback from you guys, like, as many comments as possible. Um, but I just, like, don't know. I'm feeling really, like, uninspired with it lately, and I don't want to feel that way because I love it, and I love what I do. Not that everything is about inspiration in life, but um, I don't know. I just, like... I don't know, I'm not, kind of at a loss, so let me know what you guys think and like what you want to see and just what videos you like, what things you like, what you don't like, I don't know, let me know. Okay, Dom, it's been real. I hope we're still friends after you meet with this friendship coach. I don't know, I am going to be reevaluating my friendships today, so I appreciate you giving me your car and letting me stay here even when you leave, but I don't know, I mean, whatever she says goes, so fingers crossed, I hope you're praying today. I Maybe manifest in your little mad happy journal on your way to your trip. I hope you're praying today. I hope you put on the armor of God. I hope <laughs> that God keeps you. Oh my God. Um, Lord bless you. Lord keep you. May his face shine upon you. Guys, does anyone remember when Dom was going to be a youth pastor? And give grace to you. Wow. Are you going to twerk? No. Why would you say that? You were like, you, the way you just did that, you were like going back to do it. Cut the cameras. You're not? You literally went back to twerk. Okay. Think about what you just said. You literally went back to, you literally went back. I'm a very holy person. I believe in Jesus Christ. Interesting. Seems like someone else doesn't though. Oh, huh, interesting. Goodbye, Dominique. It's been real. Wait, do I need your house key? This is actually the last time I'm going to see you. I'll leave it in the mailbox for you. Oh, thanks. Oh, well, bye Kensington. Bye Tom, love you. Bye Kensington. Bye Dominique. Oh, oh, oh wow, you're really... Bye Plaggy. Well, I'll miss you. Bye, Bla bye Plaggy Waggy. Wow. Bye Plaggy Anna. Bye Dominique. Bye. Oh, okay. let me help you. Oh. Made it back in the studio. The lighting is incredible today. It's looking great, waiting for my first guest. We're starting at 11, um, and then I have a break, and then I have three more episodes today, and then I'm done. I'm at Takaya with Keaton. I love their drinks, the strawberry basil lemonade. Like, these are the things that I miss. Oh, it's the best. All right, back to the studio we go. I have three more recordings today, and then I'm done. Guys, look who I'm with. Everyone's favorite internet celebrities these days. The What We Said girlies we just recorded. We're about to go to dinner. We don't know where yet. Um, but I'm finally done for the week, guys. I feel Yay. done. Wow. Well, it really is. How many did you do this week? Um... Like 10 for my own and then like, like 14 I think total. If there's one thing about Kenzie, she's gonna be batching. Yeah, that she's is, batching. yes. If there's one thing about me, that is what I'm gonna be doing. Yeah. All right guys, so that should basically be the end of this LA vlog. Sorry, normally I have more to vlog when I'm in LA. I just like didn't do that much and then I'm in the studio the whole time and then that's like the worst place to vlog. 
Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Dom. I just got dinner with JC and Chelsea, and it was really fun. And seeing TK, you know, I gotta just stop apologizing for my vlogs, but um, I am sorry because I was thinking this vlog was gonna be like incredible and then my body failed me so that is it i hope you guys enjoyed there's so many good podcast episodes coming i'm very excited i'm exhausted it's 8 p.m my flight is in the morning i need to just shower get in bed watch a movie pack and leave is what i need to do so hope you guys enjoyed love you guys so much and i'll talk to you in the next vlog bye and that like was kind of a light bulb moment for me where i'm like all of the things that i base my foundation on I realized were other people's experiences with the church like I didn't have that many experiences myself if I was being super honest with myself that solidified my faith for me